is the vlog here on Wazobia Max. I have absolutely, totally missed you. I've been away and been getting up to the naughtiness that Destiny and Adewa have been up to. My name is Aya Thompson and you're most welcome. Now, today I'm back and one of us is away, but not to worry, we got you covered. We have someone else who is filling the position very nicely. Again, you're mm. most welcome. This is Wazobia Max on your favorite TV station, DSTV 259 and UHF 57. Mm. Of course, I'm not alone. I have with me... The guy who didn't miss you. <laughs> I didn't miss yes, you. Yes, you did. I did You're not like, miss you. He was begging me on social eh? media. Like, are you Lord come have back mercy. To work? Come back to work. Are I you miss serious? You. No, no, the thing is, I was too busy making money. Yeah, right. Than thinking about you. Yeah, right. But you know how it is? I was here for my people. I will not abandon <laughs> you guys for anything. Like, people like Ayo, you know, <laughs> Destiny, they just run off and they just forget you guys. No. Way. But I'm always here for you to make sure I got your back. It's your boy, Adewa, AKA Fresh, on the island, on the mainland. It doesn't change. You know, we're repping it, keeping it real. You know I have to is? say, I like your look today. Hey, I you like see? the blue, and you're copying me because I did. You saw me wearing blue. No, no, I didn't see change. you wearing blue. Such a copycat. <laughs> <laughs> but I like you, and, and you're matching your chair, by yes, the way. Yes, so, oh, yeah, you know, I did not even take notes. Chair sauce. All right. Wow. Okay, now, ladies and gentlemen out there, drum roll, please. <laughs> we have a very special guest, and she's going to be co-hosting with us this afternoon. She's ready, she's fresh, and perhaps she might be challenging a devil to his title as, as a fresh and dude on set. Uh, well, <laughs> I'm not going to well. let the cat out of the bag, because I'll allow her to do her own introduction. <laughs> ladies and Gentlemen, please make welcome our guest this afternoon. Special introduction. Yay! Yeah. <laughs> no, you're supposed to do like, you know, it's 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 you know, it's a girl, you know, the flyest, the hottest, you know, the swaggest, you know. You do that so that they know that. It's your girl, it's your girl, Chris Stabel with a K and a Z. Hey. Hey. Fresh so, like that, you know. So if it's a K and a Z, it's Chris Abel. Yeah, yeah. Chris the Bell. Chris the Bell. Chris the Bell. 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 All right, ladies and gentlemen, show some love. A bit Chris of the Bell. Wee -wee down there. Go on yeah. Twitter, you know the drill. At yeah. Wazobia Max, use the hashtag blog to blog. Uh -huh. Show her some love, tell her that you want. Oh, you yeah. know, drop some bars on there. Oh, shit. Oh, I don't forget she's, to use our she's hashtag. She's called Fuba. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Chris the Bell, we're going to teach you our hashtag. Very yeah. simple. So, ha hashtag is love. A sign of love. Aww. Love, yes, two. Then two. Blog. Then you type As if you're typing. Wow. Like you're doing right, So we'll do it real quick right now. Uh, so don't to, forget to follow us yeah. at Wazobia Max. Keep your comments coming in. And in all your tweetings, yeah. if you don't put our hashtag, we cannot get to you. So yeah. use the hashtag. Love. Love. To, to then type it. Blood. Yeah, that's what's up. That's what's up. <laughs> all right, of course, you know the oh, show is yes, definitely so. <laughs> going to be live this afternoon. And this is what we have in store for you. I missed this, actually. Let's go. Are you sure you missed it? A little. <laughs> <laughs> All right, this is what to expect on the show today. So, Kevin Hart gushes about his wife after cheating scandal. We'll be looking at that. Yeah, and yeah. also, we'll be looking at the fact that Tokyo Makima talks about emotional abuse. I like her hair, by the way. So yeah. in the news this afternoon, we're looking at Kevin Hart, we're looking at Toki Makinwa, and both of them have something in common, actually. Yeah, failed marriages. Oh, very funny. Wow. Oh. Oh. Damn. Yeah, well, that was so... That was and so I've met Toki, and she's a very lovely person. I apologize on his behalf, Toki. Oh, what, what, wait, what were, you, what were you going to say? I was going to say that they had something in common. Was they didn't awesome. write a book together. <laughs> Kevin Hart has written a book. Kevin Hart has a book. So okay. they've written a book. Yes, we'll have that in common. Okay, if you say so. I'm just trying to pick your brain. Yeah, you know, no, don't get pick what my you brain. Your, don't pick your my brain and the devil's brain do not <laughs> in any way function together. Be wary of him. Yes. Me and me and you on the same I, team. I like you know, team keeping it clean. Yeah. Team nice. What this one? Team the team, Lord will have mercy. Team, 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 team swag. Yeah. Team savage. Yeah. <laughs> All right, guys. We're going to go on a quick break right now. When we come back, today's Thursday. You know what happens on Thursday. It's time to trend or trash. Yes, Afterwards, so. we will be having the facts of the day. And, of course, mm -hmm. we'll be diving straight into our story. Not forgetting, getting into a little bit of Christabel's world. Yes, Season. So. You're most 
viewers, welcome back. The set is live, we're lit. We cannot wait to start the show today. And we're really excited about Christabel. Now, we learned something very interesting about our wonderful guest this afternoon. Yes. So, Christabel, Christabel why don't you shout out to your sister. homies? She's my sister. Mommy. Alpha, 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 my people worry. Yeah. Hey. I see the saw. Why are you going to carry If I saw, if I saw, if I saw, I'm drawing. What hey. a hey. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey. Oh my God! We're not a carry <laughs> laugh. You see, I'm feeling, I'm feeling yeah. humbly now. I'm <laughs> feeling, I'm feeling like I'm in the minority at the moment. Uh, it, oh, you know, not before. But Two against one, I wait. I sabi pigeon pass anybody. <laughs> no, 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 no. My your pigeon sounds pure. petite, like no, it's too, it's too, my, it's too, my too much. Yeah. Too much pigeon. It's a fresh one. Wait till they happen. <laughs> <laughs> Oh okay, so guys, we, we need to stop being acting up. We're going to go. Um, it's time for us to trend on yeah. trash. I cannot wait to see what video we're going to be looking at. Unfortunately, yeah. our resident psychic is not here She's to tell us you. who or to guess who we are going to be reviewing today. Mm -hmm. But definitely, guys, this is where we want you to speak up. Trend or trash in a moment. Yes, sir. Hi, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, it is official. We are here. We're live. Yes, and uh, yeah. shout out to my producer. <laughs> you are not all right again. <laughs> I don't know why you had to do that, but you're not all right again. What's it's... going on with your jumper? Let me see your sweater. Why are you wearing the back of it? It's not the back of it. See, that's the problem. When you don't know. No, can we, can we zoom in? Can we let zoom us, in? Please? Let us can look, we zoom look in? at this. Because, come, because you are used to let wearing me show clothes. You, like let this. me show you. People of God, come and see. Come. Tell them. Let, them, let, let me them. see the back of this. Show them. And then, oh, this is the back of no, this. No, no. Nah. Oh, God. Look at the hands. Look at this. Let really. me see. Look, look, look at, at this. Is, look at that. Look at the hands. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> All right, so we're obviously not uh, trashing that. We're trending that. That's it. So, okay, actually, guys, maybe. let's put it put, put it to a vote. Okay. Are you trending or trashing Edewa's outfit? Do you think his sweater is very nice, or do you think nah, trashing? No. What do you think? Talking about everything, about? right? Trend the whole trash. combination. I, I, of the I liked it the, the moment I saw him. Like it's lo it's looking really good. Hey, <laughs> you see all these hairs? Hey, my no, guy, no, my guy, no, my guy. Hey. No, my guy. <laughs> Our video for today. All right, so our video for this week is by this guy has uh, been in the industry for a minute. Okay, you know, let me guess. Let me be like this. He's Destiny. really, um, he's really done a lot of. He changed uh, the kind of music people listen to for a bit. Uh, no, I'm not talking about Mr. Easy. Leave that one. <laughs> <laughs> We're moving. Okay, so Christopher, let's play this game. Well, so let's usually, play the game. Let what me see he if does I give is clues, that he gives us clues as to which artist that we can is. guess. Um, the guy is signed into a major record label. I'm, not, I'm sure you start thinking of the record labels we have that are really big. Whiskey? No. Okay, no Whiskey. Whiskey right. is like, okay, yeah. He's, yeah. He owns the record label. This is what I'm saying. He's signed under the record label. Uh, techno? Oh. No, not techno. Okay. I, said, I, I, said I didn't say the guy is, is really big like that, too. Said, the mm -hmm. answer is not really big. My account. He's a record label that is big. Oh, I know the person. I know Dremel. the person. I know the person. No, no, not Dremel. Uh, so who is the person? Johnny Drill. Clear! Oh! But I owe you one slap. <laughs> <laughs> I love, let me just put a personal disclaimer. Yes. Before we even watch this video, yeah. it's a trend for me. I love the drill. Biased people. I am so biased. Well, ladies and gentlemen, she's tango. She's not the the, uh, <laughs> the umpire of this decision-making situation. You have the power. You have to let us know. If you think this video is a trend or trash, it's your opportunity to be that person. Head on to Twitter. Get ready. This is Romeo and Juliet by Johnny Drill. When we come back, I'm going to be reading out your tweet. So do this real quick, all right? Let's go. I will be your Juliet. No, no, no. If you're I singing will be like your that, Romeo. I will fall out of love. How about I be your superman? <laughs> if that was a song. I, I will catch a grenade for you and throw no. it on you again. By the way, Adewa is lying. He said he cannot catch a grenade for any woman. No, no, no. Why, 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 why would I want to do that? <laughs> no, but he said he would throw it back. I'll throw it back at you. Uh, like you'll come back to the senses and then throw it <laughs> back. Take your grenade. <laughs> no, but there you have it. Johnny Drill, uh, Romeo and Juliet. I'm going to... Let the ladies tell us their opinion first before I drop my bomb. Thank you. Because I'm ready you. to drop a bomb right now. Thank but you. But it's fine. Ladies, okay. so Ayo and no, uh, Christabel, let's, Christabel. Let's, let's hear from you. Tell us, what, what do you think about mm. the video? Is it uh, a trend? Is it a it's trend? a go, man. It's a trend. Really? The song is good. Okay. Yeah. I'm so in love as in I want to marry Johnny. Yeah. <laughs> Stand in the queue. There's so wow. many ladies who wow. want okay. to marry him. That's quite straightforward. Marry him. Like, heads on. So, I Johnny, as you're, well, I'm sure you're watching, you know, um, Christabel has a message for you and she's passed that on to you. She's ready to so get married to you. So, do the needful. 
All right, for me, like I mentioned before the song even came on, that I already like the song. Mm. Now, from, of course, let me put it, give you a trend already, but I would say that the video, his next video should not be so like the this one. theme. The theme seems very similar yeah. to Wait For Me. Mm. It was set in the olden days. Yes, it's like the part two, or is this the official part two of Wait For Me? <sighs> so we continued. Oh, right. Okay, so when the girl died now, he had to look for another girl. Oh, I hear that. I hear that this is like a part two of Wait For Me because in part one, we think, we're not sure, and by the way, this is Mamus Amoron's um, yes, opinion. Yes, our, our producer, And she's at Musilicious on Instagram if you so want he, to attack her. Yes, yes. just go right there. She's on Instagram. M-U-S-S-Y-L-I-C-I-O-U-S. -S -S that's so, her Instagram. So probably we would, would get to bring Johnny Drew Oh, yeah, so that's the, the part yeah. where... So where he could tell us if this is a part two, oh, a it's continuation back, yes. of... Yeah. You know, yeah. the first, the previous one. So this is like a, it's, I'm sure it's a sequel that will probably have a, a third version of how they got married. I think should we should actually idea. bring, maybe next week we'll bring Johnny Drill on come the show. And talk about it. Yeah. Let people, let it be clear to people. Let them know if it's, I'm trying to shoot a movie and there's part one, part two, part three. <laughs> like in a drama movie, <laughs> I'm just saying. Classic Nollywood. But well done, Johnny Drill. I don't so think you can it's go a wrong. It's a trend. Okay, I, I think you're a bit biased. I'll, I'm not a bit. No. He's your friend? No, okay, what because I'm going to say is I noticed in the video that he wasn't smiling at any time. <laughs> <laughs> you're singing a love song. Brother, smile. Look at it. From the beginning to end, he had a face that was, I'm depressed, I'm not happy. But he's trying to sing a love song to a lady. The lady was smiling over he's and over sick. again. He's lovesick. He's lovesick. He's trying to express his yeah. uttermost feelings. He's, he's, still, he's still mourning. How do you? Like, he's really? He's mourning and he's looking for love. My brother, choose mm. one No, love just happened yeah. to him. He's, he choose one hustle. If you are mourning, mourn. If you want to look for love, look for love. <laughs> he wasn't smiling at all in the video. That's for me. But the, the whole idea, if it's a, a, a part two of the first one, then I understand why they had to take it back old yeah. school. Because we were talking yeah. about that earlier. Yeah. That, bro, yeah. Do they want to live him in the past? Mm -hmm. They should bring Johnny Drew to the, to the future. Yeah. Let's see how he'll you know, up the game. He's going to... You know, get some ladies turning, turning. No, hey. please, Johnny. Keep Johnny! It, Johnny, that's no, no, one of the things we to love about you. He has to wait for me. Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. for me. <laughs> don't, don't get no ladies turning. No, no. No, one thing I love about Johnny is that his music is clean. His videos yeah. are clean, nothing, yeah. you know, and it means that you can actually have good music without having to, you know, say nonsense, make no sense. Are you yeah. talking about David O? I did not mention any name more. Okay, I uh. thought you were talking about David O. But Adele thinks David O's songs make no sense, apparently. Is that what I said? That's what you're no, just No, I was saying. just trying to pick your brain again. No, don't pick my brain, pick your brain. <laughs> Okay, so let me head on to Twitter and see what hear what we see what people are saying about this video. Okay, um Oh, people are still trending my outfits as you're a hater. I will not read that <laughs> before you get angry no, at just read one. Lie. Just read one. Is a lie. Okay, yeah. bright underscore Uche Ode underscore Uche Hi, says bright. Edewo's outfit is cool. It's a trend. Aya, please don't harass Edewo and just call Jesus. You know, she wasn't here last I wasn't she wasn't here, here on uh, on Tuesday where we had a little baby. Or some little girls talking about if you have a problem, call Jesus. And we dedicated that to you. Oh, thank you so more much. Of the Jesus baby. Right. Thank Even you, if you thank are the you. Prodigal baby. It's fine. I'm not a prodigal You're baby. Jesus baby. So everybody who is sending a tweet is all they're still using the line call Jesus. Yes, uh, let's trend call Jesus on yes, Twitter. Yes, yes. Because okay, Akotizu says because of your outfit, I'm trending everything today. <laughs> and then every everybody that doesn't agree or like it should call Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. Nice one. You know, um, okay, uh, we have uh, Kotizu says hi guys. Aya Thompson, welcome back. Thank you, and Kotizu. Were precious. I love your hat. Oh, is it my heart or oh, my hat? Which one? Okay, I'm so taking it and uh, nice to have you, Christy. So she's saying hi. Hi, hi. thank okay. you. Nice one, nice one. So uh, we're still trying to load on, on the video. So for me, I think the video is a trend because I like the song. Okay. It has it has depth. It's <clears throat> not just singing music for yeah. people to just dance and be happy. Deep not stuff. like the people that yeah. Ayo called earlier that you know, <laughs> oh. we're singing good music, you know, because we're looking at songs that can leave you, you can stand the test of time. Yeah. That can affect our children positively. Not you are talking to your child. The child is saying, Whoa, oh yeah, mommy, <laughs> what is that? He's not trying to. <laughs> so, oh we're looking at good music that can pass, you know, make people just want to love each other. That's it. So, I think for me, nice one, guy. But please, your next song, don't do it, part three. No, we you don't can't. Don't mind the devil. Now, when you just mentioned Wo now, <laughs> I just remember the skit I saw on Instagram. I don't yeah. know if you guys know Wo Li Agba. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. As in, I've been cracking up. He did one, oh yeah, Joby, daddy, well, that guy's worse than me. <laughs> he turned war into a gospel song. <laughs> and I was saying that. that is so, <laughs> him and Dele, <laughs> oh yeah, Joby, daddy, well. then, you know, then he was like, I wish daddy are you talking about? He said, ah, it's daddy Jesus Christ. So I said, I dance like that Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> it was so funny. It was, then I turned it to, then I turned it to, um, eh, oh yeah, baby, daddy, well. Eh, we just is okay, and you're like, oh, you're okay. You want to see the ridiculous shit. Nice. But nice one, I love the creativity. Let's see how Olamide is inspiring people. Yeah? yeah. Thank you. Okay, let me read some tweets on the video now. Okay. I think we've got some. At I am Bas Gafsky. Gafsky. Sorry if I... Hi, Gafsky. Uh, the video is... I, the video is a nice video. It's a trend. And they were, I did feel your swag. I, I, so, they, you see, when haters are hating, you put them to the left. <laughs> and then you keep, to the left. Left. keep them to the left. You understand? <laughs> Let them be on the left side. Okay, um, Otumba Toby 7 says, I am good to see you. Good, thank you, Otumba Toby. Will you be my Juliet? Hey. I will be your Juliet. Hey. Ah, hey. 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 Okay, 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 it's a trend. I'm back on the Jew. Hey, <laughs> so you're second fiddle. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> So Otumba is second place. <laughs> you, how, how would it feel to be second husband? As in, wow, oh wow, big. so how does it feel to be second wife? Be second, I'm just trying to know, I don't know. It seems women are used to it already. Let's move on. Uh, okay, yeah. uh, yeah. as Glory the Poet says, uh, please, fling your nails better. <laughs> <laughs> the song is a trend. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Nice I love one. you, Glory yeah, the people Poet. People are loving the song. Uh, at Ode on the school, she said, it's not a trend for me. Don't know why, but I ain't feeling it. Oh, nice opinion, bro. I think it's good to have people on the other yeah, side. Yeah, it's of, good to hear. Yeah. It would be yeah. nice to know why you're not feeling it. Yeah, yeah, you could tell us if you find out, you figure out why you don't like it, just let us know. At AO3 Creation says, Oh, yeah, join Christopher. Oh, yeah, that's Christopher. Oh, oh. Christopher. You're loving Christopher. Well done, oh, the song is a trend, but the guy needs prayers. Uh -uh. Uh -huh. At Okili Chris 1. Bros, wow. what did he do to you? He needs prayers. Ah, that's deep. Oh. Okay. All right then, let's 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 just keep keep it coming. Uh, probably we'll get to read uh, your tweets early next time. Let's All keep right, it wonderful. But okay. I think a lot of people want to trend the song, so yes, it's a trend. It's yeah. a trend from yes. us all. So uh, God bless you, Johnny Jewel. Thank you for producing uh -huh. fantastic says, music. Johnny Jewel is an awesome musician. Yeah. At U S U P H twenty four. Well, how am I supposed to pronounce that? <laughs> awesome. Yusuf. U S. Yeah? Is that you? Nice. Wow, U S U P. Oh. You so ah, ah, please chop Bluetooth knuckle. Okay, 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 okay. Let me you give know. you the one I've chopped. Oh, yeah, no, I don't want your one. I don't be speaking bad English. <laughs> <laughs> right, well, that's so good. That's good. That's good. Be, okay, we're, we're going to do the tr um, the fact of the day. Yeah. Christopher, if you could help us read the fact of the day every yes. day, every time we come on the show, we have a an interesting fact. We'll so it'll be on your TV screens, and then Christopher can help us read out. We'll to educate the people. All right. Let them know that we are good. All right. Did you know a flock of crows is known as a murder? Eh? Wow. wow. Oh, Shamo, a flock you know of what, crows. You um, what this girl was talking about? Um, Shay Shay. Shay Shay. They, um, out oh. in the street, they call it murder. murder. No, I don't a think crowd, so. A group of I don't crowd. think she was talking about crows. <laughs> I was talking about the way she used to kill people on the street. <laughs> oh, yeah. But yeah, that's, but that's quite But interesting fact, like, she say murder of crow, Isn't crows. Isn't that too savage? Mm. Out in the street. They call him murder. What the no, what's, it was Shay Shay. Anyway, nothing to do. Shay Shay. Pardon? It's still a savage. Oh, he was still sneaky. Thank you. Nice one, nice one, nice one, nice one, nice one. You need to just stay, stay It was Cynthia Morgan, Cynthia Morgan and Shay Shay did one, but I don't know, I can't. Just stay in church. Please. I Let's remain in church. I'm proud to If he now told me something like, Nani give a chimo. Come on, I'm also a church girl. You see, she's also a church girl. She still knows outside music. I know outside music. <laughs> Which one? I know. Uh, Johnny Drew. Oh, yeah, daddy. Oh, yeah, Joby, daddy. <laughs> 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 you know what, um, Christopher, let's get to meet you a oh little. My God. So uh, before we get to the, you know, to you, you, someone asked the question on Twitter that they wanted to be your Romeo and you be yeah. your Juliet. Now, for those who are watching, who are looking at you, who admire you, mm -hmm. what are the qualities that you look out for? Are you, first of all, are you in a relationship, single, married? Um, very single. Very single. Yeah. So what are the qualities that you look out for in a man? Uh, well, I was talking with someone yesterday and he was like, he told me, said, you have to first marry yourself. Yes. That is the only way you can actually describe it. No, no, let me try say yes, yes. What do you mean by you have to first marry you yourself? You have to first marry yourself. You have to assess, like, what, what do you want in yourself? 
that is the kind of person like your the kind of man you should want should be able to you know like bring out like bring the dream into the, into the limelight like help you out in all this like you know so the kind of man i should be looking out for or any other woman should be looking out for first of all he must he has to know how to pray mm. like hmm. he has to really and pray what's a prayer warrior uh, ah! because i can't be we have to be able to Connect. function in spirit that's mm. right and then uh, it has to be really tall. Yeah, this really? is go church. I'm not thinking they go church. Right? Edewa, is, yeah. I'm even thinking of the criteria for Edewa. Yeah. Edewa is praise. Yes. Uh, it has to be supportive. Yeah. You don't marry a man that will kill your dream as soon as yes. you get married. Yes. Like, you know, uh, what, it if, has to be. what if the man has a dream, yeah, yeah. and both of your dreams don't align? You, what would first happen? of all, before you get married to someone, you must have been with that person. You know, you must have had an experience. You can't be with me if you don't, if you're, if so you, you if you're not in my world. You have to be in my space. Okay. Like we both have to be in. So can you, know, you get married to someone in your industry, like doing the same thing you do? Uh, well, it's not compulsory, but yeah, we can work it's it possible, out. It's possible, right? Yeah, it's possible. But what if there are times where you have to go here, you have to go here, you guys don't have time for each other because you're too busy? Wouldn't that be a problem? Mm, time. You know. <laughs> Very true. Now let's now we ask. I mean, Adele said, um, "What if can you marry someone in your industry?" Yeah. Let's talk about what you do. So please let the world know who Christabel is. Yeah. I, 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 Christabel is a rapper, okay. mm. a gospel rapper. Mm. You know, like, uh, okay, that is just about what I do. You do it for uh, Jesus. I do it for Jesus. I, I have to do for I, for the Lord. I, I do it for the Lord. Lord challenge. You I have, have to switch my it. lyrics for the Lord. Yay! <laughs> Love it, love it, love it. And yeah. I think it is so apt to bring you here this time because we know what's been trending on Instagram and yeah. social media. So mm -hmm. if you don't mind, before the end of the show, you know, you just spit some She's gonna lyrics spit for, the Lord. for the Lord. Yeah. And I'll yeah. be giving you the... Uh, uh, no, don't give, her, uh, don't give her anything, please. <laughs> we would like to hear her. Let's not spoil it. You understand? Please. Let's keep it As original, please. Let's do what did she do wrong? Go air uh, your uh, own, okay. If you don't really want your music to sell, put her on your track. <laughs> Forget it. It's a rap. <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> I don't have anything to say to Adele. Nothing. Uh. But we're going to go on a break now. When we come back, we will be looking at our story. And we'll begin to talk to Christabel a bit more. Also, don't forget that we also give you the opportunity to ask any question at all on Twitter to Christabel. Now, she mm -hmm. has the opportunity or the privilege to say whether she'll answer or, or not. not yes. Also, we have her video standing by, so you get to see a little bit of what Christabel is about. A lot in store for you on the show this afternoon, so you don't want to go anywhere. See you soon. Mm. Yeah. You're most welcome back. Thank you very much for tuning in. This is the blog here on Wazobia Max. We're entering the second half of the show. Yep. We've had a very interesting first half, and you can see me beaming with smiles. We have mm. a wonderful guest with us. Her name is Christabel, and she told us a little bit of what she does in the first half of the show. She's a rapper, and we will be certainly hearing her drop some lyrics with, you know, yours truly featuring on that track. <coughs> <laughs> And haters to the right. Yeah. To the right, ah. to the right. Oh, wow. <laughs> Which means you need me if I'm to your right, you know? All right. Okay, so let's go to our first story right now. Don't forget, we want you to be a part of this. So head on quick, quick, quick to Twitter. At Wazobia Max. Use the hashtag love to blog and we'd love to take your comments. But our first one is with this lovely lady I met recently, Toke Makima. Toke Makima talks about emotional abuse. Now, media girl Toke Makima has taken to Twitter to talk about emotional abuse in relationships. Toke, who attributed this as one of the things that led to the end of her marriage, bar bared her mind in series of tweets. All right, so I'll be reading out the tweets to you. And she said, you hear of a man divorcing his wife and out of bitterness inflicts the pain on his children. He doesn't pay school fees. Hmm. Some mothers hmm. take the frustration of the fathers out on their kids. Some fathers in a bid to get back at their wives do the same. You hear how some parents talk down on their children, the harsh words used to correct them, magnifying their weakness, and in some cases, when people hear emotional abuse, they are quick to think man-woman dynamic. But do you know, Parents emotionally abuse their kids too. Very well said. Very, very well said. I'm glad she's highlighted this. All right, now the question we're asking or we're discussing this afternoon, and this one is something that I would like as many people as possible out there to talk about because I'm sure that we all have had one encounter or the other with emotional abuse. 
the effect of emotional abuse on children, particularly with worrying parents, because mm -hmm. this is so true. When parents, they say when two elephants fight, is the grass that suffers. Mm -hmm. And in this case of marriage, when two individuals parents. fight, mm -hmm. it's the children that suffer. So let's talk about that. Well, I feel, okay, Christopher, what do you have to say about that? That's our guest, did you have anything? To yeah, say? Okay. yeah. Growing up, um, I, I met, there's this family around my neighborhood mm -hmm. and the parents would always fight. And then you, like the lifestyle of those children, they were, they were mostly terrified and then they would come to school, sit at the back mm -hmm. of the class, mm -hmm. very quiet and moody. And you know, it actually affects them emotionally. Mm. I don't think any, any child should actually grow up in such a home. It's, mm. it's not nice at all. Like, mm. you know, they tend to get angry, yes. beat up other students. Because you know, what they see. Yeah, they, they become bullies at the end of the day. Mm. And you know, it's, it's not nice Very, at very all. true, very uh, true. I feel that sometimes uh, parents, some parents are, some pe people, parents act selfishly because mm. it's all about, it's about them. If you can't understand that if you're in that marriage, not for yourself and also for the next person and the kids, that's when you can decide to just react uh, irrationally when things happen. That, um, are, like I said uh, some time back, that there are some parents who still live together, not because they love each other, yeah. Yeah. but because of the kids. Yeah. They know that if they separate, yeah. they have given the children um, um, a different idea of marriage, that if you get married and you're not happy, you can just, just break it up. You yeah. know, so but because they want to let the children believe that okay, this marriage is happily ever after, yeah. even in the pain and the struggle, I will still be there to because of the children, because of the next generation you are trying to impart, you will just be there and make them believe that it's good, so that when they grow up, even if they have issues, they're already used to the okay, we have to stay together no matter what it looks like. Yeah. So growing up in a, in a separated home, sometimes, well, most times, it's usually difficult for the child. Because and there was a friend of mine I have, he grew up in a separated home, but he was quite happy with it because there are times when he needs stuff. He'll go to his mother, he'll get it. He'll go to his father, he'll get it. Yeah. So he gets double of everything. Yeah. No, but, but let, me, let, me, let, me, let me ask you a question with regards to what you just yeah. said. Now, another school of thought says that it's actually better for parents who cannot stand to live with each other to separate for the sake of their children. Okay. The reason yeah. being that the children, like you mentioned in that case, are exposed to so much hurt, yeah. um, hurt mm -hmm. anger, upset, and like Tokia Makima mentioned, are almost used as the pawn in the fight between yeah, both yeah. parents. Between, yes. So in that case, it actually does more harm to the child staying than together. Yeah, staying together, together and being, yeah. you understand? This because or if the child sees the father hitting the mother, yeah. and you're there, you See, you grew up thinking that that's yes, how it's men... Okay to hit. It's okay you to hit that? a woman. Growing up, yeah, I would, I would never hit a woman. Growing up, I never saw my dad hit my mom, no matter the argument. And the funny thing is that we never saw arguments like yeah, that. Yeah, that's what people say. Well, because they had... Every time there's an argument, I would rather probably meet my mom in the room when she's moody. And I'm like, <laughs> what's, what's the problem? And she just... Ah, you fine, look like I'm, a mommy's boy, by the way. Fine. Yeah, I am, actually. She's like, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. But if they're going to have an argument, it's probably in their room. Yeah. You wouldn't know That's anything. Very good. Probably when they come outside, she will still go and cook for him. He will still eat. Really? She, yes. And they'll still sit in the parlor. We'll still watch TV. When she wants to go, she goes to sleep. He goes to sleep. <laughs> but you would, because I'm close to her, yeah. I'll be like, okay, there's something wrong somewhere. You're yeah. not the way you are supposed to be. Yeah. And she'll tell me, okay, maybe this was something that happened, but it's all right. Yeah. She'll always want to paint the picture that it's yes. all right. Please let us give her that was mom's you know? she around yeah, us. Yes. You know, Mrs. Andre, she, I, I love you. you know, as in, I don't know, I'm going to do 12 mom. gun, 21 uh, gun salutes. Okay, 21, <laughs> Charlie. <laughs> if you shoot 21 times, nobody No, we need hear. to hear you know? all of these experiences yeah. more and more. You know, because yeah. what's in the media, are uh, marriage is not working, mm -hmm. things that, yeah. so, the idea of people... People are beginning to get that, that idea, like, marriages don't work. Exactly. Yes. Like, if you get into it, it's not... It's, it's, I mean, look at what you're that. saying about your mom and your dad. If, you know, and they've been married for... God knows when. It's been long. That's you beautiful. Know, it's been long. Oh, I wouldn't say it's been perfect. Of course. But... Yeah. Even friendships are not perfect. Exactly. Even with your exactly. siblings, it's you not understand. perfect. But them deciding to stay together because of the sake of the next generation. For the sake of, say... Sake of say, <laughs> hey, for the sake of say, want say, you know, but they don't just want to, 
I, I, it, we had neighbors who every morning we hear, yeah, yeah. something, you know, they were, bring, bring <laughs> bottles, bring, at, at, at the end, the children, like you said, were traumatized, yeah. they were yeah. angry for no reason, yeah. they, were, they were sad, they were, to them, it was all about themselves now, yeah. they were selfish, yeah. because everything was, why am I wasting my time trying to please this yeah. next person, if everything about being together is almost a lie. Exactly. You get me. So but how about even parents who, like what Toke mentioned, with regards to the fact that because I'm not in good terms with your mother, I'm not going to pay your school fees. <laughs> we mm. know, no, it happens. Yes, that happens we know that happens of parents who get divorced, and because of that, they say that the kids. yes, they mm. divorce the mother and the child. And the child. So they don't just. They <laughs> so why do why do men or women do like that? Or you know that, or some men. I mean, we've had extreme cases where some men would kill the children because they know mm. it would affect, exactly. the affect the woman. Yeah. You're trying to revenge, and mm. then you kill your own children because you think. The mother, obviously, you know the love a mother has. Yes. Why do we do that? You know, some, we need to start talking about this because she's very correct. Society mm. has to talk about that. We talk about broken homes, or sometimes we don't think about the children who mm. are victims of emotional abuse. Mm. Mm. It's all very about true. knowing what right. you're there for. Yeah. Guys, we want to hear from you as well. You know, have you had experiences in the past, or what do you have to say um, from what Toke Makinwa says? I, I mean, thank God she's speaking out. I think one thing I have to applaud her for is the fact that she's not keeping quiet. And oh, I thought you were going to say she's not talking about herself. No, <laughs> I know she talks about herself. But she's not keeping quiet. And she tries, okay. she's a, I think she's a woman that wants to, she's gotten it, no, she, unfortunately she didn't get it right herself. Mm -hmm. But she, you know that she believes in marriage and she mm -hmm. wishes that other people would learn either from mm -hmm. her mistakes or um, improve. I, th true, I mean, that, that's what yeah. I think. True. All right. Okay, let me just read this quick tweet that just dropped. At uh, Franz Six Tweets, he says, Toke is on point. It is really a torture emotionally, you know, seeing that kind of situation. Not, not a bad idea. Um, David Aderele says, no matter how bad the situation is, watching you guys on this show has always yeah, has always made me happy. Oh. Ah, and they will take it easy on the iron. What am I doing? Thank you. I'm Thank just you. sitting Thank here. You. Oh, David, hi, my, 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 that's my G. They look at you because they, they don't they, 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 no, they, they, no, 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 no. Me. me and David do not. Nah, David that we became friends after I upset him. Remember oh, yeah. 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 Hi, David. <laughs> look at you. Okay, then Otumba Toby 7 says, okay, he's talking to Chris now. Any plans working with Buki, and how do you plan to take gospel rap to the next Nice, level? nice. nice I'm, one. So we're coming back Otumba to you, Toby, Christabel. Yes. Before yes. we answer Otumba Toby's question, we nice. will answer it. But I wanted to ask you, linking in with what the question we've just spoken yeah. about, you know, tell us about growing up, your family background, and then that very important question. Now, a number of parents when you say, Daddy, I want to do music. You say, Mew, Mew. <laughs> I want to be a rapper. Ra ra rap what? what? So what how did you your parents take you going into music? Mm -hmm. You know, just tell us a little bit about that. Okay. Should I start from growing up or yes, how, yes, in yes, yes. how they took it? Up and growing then up, yes. Okay, okay. I'll, have to, I'll go all out. Uh, well, growing up was it was good. My father was a pa my father is a pastor. Ah, you for me? Yeah, I'm a pastor. Spiritual. Pastor. Spiritual. <laughs> yeah. So, um, well, I got of school, you know, university. Did you go to university here in Nigeria? Yeah, okay. I went to one of the schools. What school? <laughs> Not today. Oh, okay. All right. So, um, it was it was quite hard, like growing up, uh, teenager, pressure from everybody, mm. you know, drugs, you know, you know, smoking. I've done all those stuff, man. Really? Yeah, mm. yeah. I've been into all that. this is very interesting. You have to tell mm. us. I'm <laughs> glad I asked this question. You know, from doing drugs to, you know, I, you know, if somebody that can do drugs, smokes, mm. everything, everything, smoke anything that's bringing out smoke. This mm. was actually, was this actually pressure of the society or peer pressure? What happened? What I think it was that? more of a wanting to, you Experience. know, to be among them. Mm. You know, coming from this church home, like, ah, you have to pray in the morning, yeah. and then I get to school and nobody's asking me to pray. Oh wow, <laughs> <laughs> that is how the devil puts it. You know, yeah. this yeah. is freedom. In quote, so I lost it. I lost it a while. My mom, you know, she was stressed. So they didn't like the whole idea. Like, no, man, I'm going to be a rapper. <laughs> or more mm. bad rapper then in mm. school, you know, how it was like. So after a while, like, you know, like until last year, I met. You met Jesus. Yeah. Really? <laughs> yeah. So, just, just last year. Just last year. Wonderful. I'm, I'm, I'm a year old, so. Wonderful. So it was like that, man. I met Jesus and, you know, I wanted to quit it all for, you know, I. I didn't do anything for like a year. 
Mm. Exactly, yeah. It's like just three months ahead now. Okay. So like I decided to stop it. Like I don't want to do this. This rap is what is making me do all these things. Mm -hmm, no, mm -hmm. I wanna do it again. Mm. Those, you know? And then he told he told me, he said, you have to let them know know about this. Like they need to know what you've done. Mm. Like if you listen to some of most of my songs, I'm talking about my experiences, drugs, clubs, everything, everything as in back to back. Mm. So now telling them now that I want to be a rapper. At least it is better than the old rapper. <laughs> so they are actually very excited. Mm. They are happy. So your parents are in support of this? Yeah, they are in support of it. I love that. Yeah. I, I didn't even know this story, I'm, and I'm really glad to hear this. And I'm glad yeah. that you are very vocal about it. The problem we have sometimes is that people have a story and they hide and it. They, they want to paint a picture of nah. mm. And yeah, there are people who can listen to you. People who are watching, they are probably in the, still in that situation, situation and yeah. can see that they can come out of this and still fulfill, fulfill their dreams. Mm. All right, now talking nice. about your dreams, we will come back to Tumba's, Toby's yeah. question. Mm. But we have your video standing by. I, I believe it's standing by because I'd like people to see Christabel in her act, mm. doing what she loves doing the rapper that she is, and then we'll come back to the question about you going into collaborations with Bookie. Enjoy. B-O-U-Q-U-A. <laughs> I honestly, I think that's such yeah. a beautiful video, and I think it's Very richer inspiring. hearing you know, your story. Look, yeah. the, the way this, I listened to the song, and I realized that, like you said, this is a personal story. Yeah. So that was why the delivery was so in, in, intense. Yeah. Because you could tell that I'm not just telling you things that I think yeah. can happen. I'm things telling I've you experienced. things that I know and things that I've experienced. Yeah. So this is this is quite a very, very deep something. Very deep. So very deep. what inspires your I mean, of course, I know your experiences, yeah. but how do you get into the zones? Because, you know, I'm asking you this. Some people say they cannot quit their addictions because that's how they get inspired. Yeah. In fact, we spoke about it here on the show once, mm. that who was the artist? Was it Whiskey, though, who said It was, uh, was Whiskey. That said that he, can, he, can only, he cannot produce good music if he's not high. Yeah. And we want to debunk that because, of course, you can do that. I mean, look at you. So what yeah. inspires you if you're not high and yet you can produce She's such... high on the Holy Ghost. Yeah, <laughs> I, yeah I'm high on the high Holy, Holy Ghost. Ghost. Yeah. You know? Well, I thought I can do it, though. Like, man, how will I do it? No drugs. Mm -hmm. You know? I'll just stay focused. I think before I do any song, I pray. I ask him, what, what do you want me to say? What do you want me to do on this song? Mm -hmm. And then he gave me this song. I didn't even know I was going to do this and free song. I went to the studio to do something else mm -hmm. entirely different. And then, you know, he says, somebody out there needs to know that you can get out. So he inspires me. He has the Holy Spirit. I don't want to go all, all around spiritual, but that yes. is just how it is. Yes. He inspires mm -hmm. me. Mm -hmm. Great stuff. Nice, nice. Great Someone stuff. said, uh, uh, David Akerini says, Christabel, I love the video. Reminds me of Lauren Hill. Good mm. one. This is the kind of video we want to see on TV. Wonderful. So you're already you. inspiring people, you know. All people. right. Now, nice. Christabel's handle is scrolling on your TV screen, so we'd mm -hmm. love for you to show her yeah. some love. Follow her on Twitter, Instagram, and all social media platforms. It's right there on your TV screen. So please, please support and, you know, let her know that you love her music and that yeah. you like what she's doing. Yeah. So I, do you do shows? Do you go to, um, you know, if people invite you, do you do that? Yeah, sure, of course. Okay. All for the kingdom. Yeah. For a man's gift. Yes. Make it. Make it. Make it. Make it. Exactly <laughs> Receive the emblem. <laughs> 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 you tried something else. Okay, I'm not sure if we have time <laughs> oh for the second, God. for the yeah. last story, oh but of God. course we said we okay. were, okay, so we're going to go to our last story because we have, um, we have a bit of time. So Kevin Hart gushes about his wife after cheating scandal. Following his embarrassing cheating scandal, Kevin Hart is gradually rebuilding his wife's trust. Even though many may never look at their relationship the same, the comedian and actor took on Instagram to praise her. He also told critics to feel free to drop hateful comments he wrote. Yeah, and he wrote to the left comments. <laughs> Thanking God for this beautiful, strong woman that I'm lucky enough to still be calling my wife today. You are truly amazing. Love you. Hashtag WCW, hashtag, mm, hashtag hearts. P.S. Please feel free to insert your hate below and so, so, and so on. Anyways, this is what um, our question is for you today. Is it possible for a relationship to be the same after a partner cheats? Mm, wow, this is whoa. a very good question. It, Guys, please go on Twitter, yes or no. Is it possible for the relationship... Yes, just let us know. Yes or, or no. no. For go the relationship to, to be the quick. same, because we have only about four minutes to go. Yes. Relationship to be the same after the partner cheats. What do you think, Christabel? Do you think it's possible? 
No. 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 <laughs> Why not? Uh, you said yes or no now. No, that's our Twitter <laughs> people. That's our Twitter people. <laughs> well, no, because, you know, that trust is already gone. Mm. And that is like, the trust is like the base. Love is not enough. Uh -huh. So after the trust, you can now bring love. So like the trust is already gone. Maybe if he smiles at his friend now, she'll start thinking, <laughs> who are you smiling at? You know, you know that kind of it's already ruined everything. Mm -hmm. It might work, but not as it were, you know. Before. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You know, but looking at it though, we're humans and it's easier to point a finger at the next person if you're not the one involved in the situation. Now, you're in a relationship where maybe this person does something wrong, like you said. And there's a particular time, maybe in the future, you get to do something wrong. Would you say because he did that and you couldn't let go, do you know that you also want him to think about it as, ah, I just did that, you should forgive me if you love me. So I feel that if we stop being thinking about ourselves alone in relationship, mm -hmm. then it gets to a point where we can get to understand that people make mistakes, but if you're going to make it work, you should learn how to see beyond that and start yeah. afresh. I, I actually agree I with you, Adele. So. I'm, I'm, I, I would have said never in the past, but I've also realized that sometimes, because like you said, there's no human being that is infallible. Anyone mm. can fail. Mm. Because put yourself in the situation. We like to give ourselves excuses that, oh, this is me, please. <laughs> yeah. Because I don't think there's any human being you, you can, um, that cannot change. I believe that very, you yes. will not be able to change the person, but there's no human being that cannot. And sometimes, yes, the idea out there is that once a cheat, always a cheat, actually not. There's some people who've done it once and they felt so bad they would never do it again, not mm -hmm. even because of you. It might be because of God, higher, you know, yeah, uh, authority. Okay, okay. So if, for me, it would depend largely on the person's, in yes, I'm not denying the fact that for the first few years or months, you might be looking at the person, you may be wary, but the, actually, like what I said, the person that you need to work on the most is yourself, mm. in terms of your trust, building that trust again. Because if you decide to forgive the person and go ahead with that relationship, you need to be, because for instance, in marriage, I mean, Destiny and I always talk about the fact that outside of marriage, mm. I would not, but when you get married, I don't believe in divorce. Yeah. We have to sort it out, we have to work it out. <laughs> so it must I, work. Yeah, it must work. If one person <laughs> slips <laughs> up, yeah, if one person slips up, we just have to find a way to make it work. It's yeah. not easy. I'm not even downplaying the fact that, because it's very hurtful. It takes time. It might take counseling, but it is yeah. possible. Uh, some people have been able to recover from, um, from cheating. But different strokes, different folks, if you can't handle it, make sure that you know the person you're ending up with. Yeah. Yes. All right. Before that, we, that. So, so let me just read okay. some tweets about it. Uh, at Katizu says, yes, I have my reasons. Like, she has her reasons why. But when we ask for yes or no, <laughs> all right, all right, but it's good. Um, at Ade underscore dot says, why not? With God, all things are possible. Mm -hmm. If Two-Face can marry Annie, what else? I can't believe you just brought two Wow. Strong, I, I, strong I'm point. reading a tweet, so it's not me. <laughs> At Ade underscore dot says that if two pays can marry Annie, who are you? Who are you not to forgive? That's a good one. Good uh, one. Pearl underscore Troy says, yes, the trust can be rebuilt. It's about, yes, building. You can do it again. Yeah. Uh, At Francis tweet says, yes and no. It depends. Yes. You are a politician. Yeah. Because <laughs> you are here and there. You are not straightforward. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Adele, please, we, can, we need to just ask, um, you know, one final right. time yeah. from Christabel, what the future plans are, any projects we should be looking forward to, and of yeah. course that big question, would you be would looking you? at any collaborations in the future? Yes. Mm. Okay, projects, yeah. I just um, dropped my album online. Okay. So, um, bars, blessed after repentance, ah. saved. Oh, so, deep, 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 D A R S, guys. Deep. Blessed yeah. after repentance, saved. saved. Bars. Yeah. So, uh, that's one major project. So, mm. soon to be on iTunes. Already on iTunes. Already on iTunes. How, how, how many tracks are on the album? Four. Four tracks, nice. Come one on. um, one bonus track, nobody. Okay. We've got I'm um, free. Patience, bars, mm -hmm. and nobody. Okay. So yeah, major projects. We've got like two videos already. The one you've seen, and then a viral video going around. Okay. And of course, yeah, we're working on something. Um, well. So they should just follow you. Look at me. and prophetic. And yeah. <laughs> yeah. So do you? Are you signed to any record label at the yes, moment? Yes, I'm signed to AO3V Creations. Oh, okay. So. 
We're doing something. How is something. how is it? How does it feel being signed to a record label? Is it like, do you mm. feel boxed? Nah. You feel free? You know, I didn't actually expect. I, I didn't think I was going to thrive as a gospel rapper. Mm. Okay. You know, you know, I I'm a redeemer. <laughs> ah, that's my sister mm. in the Lord. You know, mm. how will you be a rapper in RCCG and then I'm the first to like actually come out? So it feels good. Mm. You know, it's, I'm it's, good. it's quite nice that you actually enjoy what you're doing. I mean, it's yeah. written all over you. It shows that you're really having fun doing it. Yeah. That. If you were, if you had the, if you had to do something else, if you were not going to be a rapper, what would you have been? Oh, wow. <laughs> if you look at it, you know, oh, deep this big occupations we have in Nigeria. What would you have rather been doing if not rapping? That should still be revolving around the entertainment entirely. Oh, okay. Like I don't see myself doing anything else. To enjoy more of this our Ogunge videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.